what's up what's up good morning guys welcome to dfs nba segments for draft king slate of february 5th i'll go by invisible dfs let's go ahead and check segment one and see how the guys did the night before Uh, as far as the night before, uh, CP3, Paul, 38.25, uh, 5.8x, not bad. Uh, Sadowinski, uh, he didn't even play in the entire fourth quarter. Still returned a 6.7x. Six, 6 Aiden, 5.3x. We're always looking for a little bit more than that. Jackson, 2.8x that was really bad and that's no all and jackson he got his start but was really bad the entire game collins had uh 32.75 after the second quarter and basically he didn't return he got hurt so he didn't play the third or the fourth quarter so once that happened my night basically was over because i had collins everywhere and he was on his way to have a great night. So basically that bring my night down in both DK and FD. Anyway, the total 154.50, that actually that was really, really bad. Um, my other three players was Giannis. He was great, 67.75. Forbes, 23.25. And Mills, 21.25. The total was 266.75. That lineup itself didn't cash. I had a lineup with those uh that's barely cash with three my three core players uh without uh actually with collins my three core players but not uh not jackson that one was barely cash basically it was a bad night in uh dk and fd i returned most of i mean in the yeah in fd i returned most of my money so let's go ahead and check to uh jump to segment two and check the five players as far as the price differences between the two sides. Right now, guys, it's basically uh, seven in the morning. I have yet to go to sleep, so as soon as I get this done, I'm gonna go straight to sleep. Uh, that's why you can tell I'm a little bit tired. But anyway, let's go ahead and do that. Uh, the five players are Paul George, 10.2k uh, in ZK, 11.6 in FD, 1.4k difference Towns, 9.7k, 10.7, uh, 1k difference Lillard, 9.9, uh, 8.9k. That's really a great price, but they are playing against my team, Miami Heat, but in Portland. So that's a great price, and that's the only game I believe. Yeah, that's the only game. Most of the games. By the 8 o'clock, 8.30, they will start. And this is the only game, I believe, that's at 10 or 10.30. Uh, Siemens, uh, 8.6K, 1.1K difference. I like that price. And uh, offered, of course, at 6.6K without Kyrie. Uh, I like it. Uh, 1.4K difference. Anyway, guys, let's go ahead and jump to segment three. And, of course, that's what I call the main ingredient of the show. Where I'm going to give you guys my three calls, one cheap place, and of course the star of the segment. Let's go to the ZK website and let's do that. Alright, where is my note? Alright guys, as far as the, far, the first play I have for you guys is... Oh, that's not it. Alright, there it is. Van actually I'm gonna go with uh, Dennis Smith Jr. I know the first game you know he started in a bad note where he picked up two quick foul in the first three minutes of actually first two minutes of the game so against Detroit let's hope that's not the case but at that price I expect him to play a lot of minutes so uh, he played 25 minutes or well, 26 minutes last game and that's because and he was in power trouble so Dennis Smith Jr. is my definitely core player for me and the second guy I'm going for of course is Ben Fleet
uh, my apology guy, Ben Fleet actually is gonna be somebody I use later, but not Ben Fleet, I mean uh, Reggie Jackson. In that same game, Reggie Jackson is my second core player. Reggie Jackson, on he was a blowout, so I know you guys probably gonna see how he did last night, but it was a blowout. He basically, and uh, those guys basically didn't play in the fourth quarter. It's crazy. Troy blew out uh, Denver last night, and most of the starters I didn't play at all in the fourth quarter. So, including Reggie Jackson. So, uh, Reggie Jackson, he's been playing a lot of minutes lately, and definitely gonna be a core player for me. My third core player. I'm gonna go with white side. White side right now, the best time to play white side is when the, the Heat are playing uh, a team that have a center that doesn't really show trees, that doesn't really move around much. That's basically the, almost the same style as white side. That's when you're gonna get some upside or play more minutes. So I'm hoping that Nurkic gonna play. If that's the case, then white side should be a great at six foot nine k so white side is my third core player probably not gonna be popular especially it's in the last game but it's good to know that you're gonna have a guy with good upside in the last game especially if your lineup are looking great going to the last game so white side is my third core player we all know white side got the upside just in to get the minutes and then of course my cheap play guys it's i'm going back to ben fleet is my cheap play usually i go 4.5k and below but ben fleet will be the guy i'm gonna go with without uh larry is not expecting to play so ben fleet should see all the minutes at the point guard position so hopefully uh he play uh, between high 20s to to the 30s that's what i'm hoping for if that's the case then at 4.6 i will definitely use them as my cheap play and guys i'm sending this game for my star and who that is that's Kawhi. yes i'm gonna go with Kawhi. uh that's gonna be the first time i use them in my show but Kawhi should definitely go off just like he did the first time they they, they play against each other. So Kawhi is my star of the show. I know uh, he has been disappointed. Uh, you know, he hasn't really been doing, playing good as a star. If you look at his last two games, 34 and 29 fantasy points. But this game, I expect him to get at least 50 fantasy points. The last time they play, and they, have been, they, are, they already played two games. He averaged 34 minutes and 58 fantasy points. I'm expecting something like that or even better. So, Kawhi is my star. So, let's go ahead and do segment four and see my cheapies. As far as the cheapies, guys, uh, Gil Alexander, I really like him at 4.4k. Everything is trending up right now. The minutes are going back up, and he's actually playing really great and it's fantasy it's showing in the fantasy uh place too uh joseph 4.4k is the starter at the two at the shooting guard but he hasn't been doing good uh sexton 4.2k without Asman, it should be better because Asman expecting to miss a uh, couple of weeks i believe so sexton should be better and bullock 4.2k had a great game last night without even playing in the fourth quarter Zere 4K he is probable, so he should be back, but he might be on a uh, minute restriction. So that's uh, something you guys should make sure you guys make sure that you guys know how many minutes he's playing before you guys putting putting him on your lineup. Olinik 3.9K back to back over 30 fantasy points, um, but I cannot choose him because you know it's it's all game dictate, meaning like uh, if. You know, if he's in the game and he's playing good, most likely he's gonna go ahead and play a little bit more minutes than usual. But I cannot trust that. I cannot trust Spol so only most likely. I might take a fly on him, but for right now I'm not sure. 
y2 and 8k could see enough minutes to be a factor in zfs and what about 3.6k if he gets the start he definitely in play uh you know mostly in fd in dk i don't know if you want to go there and ties 3.5k the main backup right now at center so that's a guy you can take a chance on because here and there he got some good upside but it's not a promise all right guys that's basically it guys um i'm going straight to bed and i have no idea when i'm gonna wake up i'm gonna try to get me that house sleep anyway guys good luck i wish you guys the best let's go ahead and win some money let's hope in as as far as my place i hope this you know today is better than last night because uh once calling was out basically my night was basically over and i still end up cashing actually i cashing in fd but dk i cash just a little bit anyway guys i appreciate you guys thank you for always coming out and check my videos and um hey nights all basketball as, as you know i will drop a video every single day for dfs basketball good luck i appreciate you guys good luck i appreciate you guys turn on your notification and don't spend money that you guys cannot afford to lose and i'm out